Welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to be discussing three different methods to massage the body using your Cavity Shine body sculpting device, the Sculpt Skin Mini. First and foremost, make sure that everything is plugged in in the back. Once it is plugged in and everything is working properly, make sure your body is very well lubricated. The first method we're going to be discussing is the circular method. This method is highly effective for the abdomen. The technique involves placing the wand on your abdomen and moving it in slow, deliberate circles. Keep consistent contact with the skin to ensure that the ultrasonic waves penetrate the fat cells effectively. The circular motions help to distribute the ultrasonic waves evenly across the belly fat, ensuring a uniform effect. The cavitation process then creates bubbles in the fat cells which burst and turn the fat into liquid form. The abdomen is notorious for holding on to stubborn fat that doesn't easily go away with diet and exercise. The circular motion ensures the ultrasonic waves evenly penetrate this difficult area, making it easier for your body to break down and eliminate the fat. It is imperative that you do this in slow, slow circular motions. It is also very important that you are very well lubricated, so be generous with your conductive gel. Be patient and dedicate the time. Again, it is 15 to 20 minutes per body part during your sessions. It, they should be done every three days, for every 72 hours, ideally twice a week, but they must be spaced out 72 hours. Again, method number one, the circular motions for the abdomen. Now we're going to move on to the love handles. For the love handles, what is most effective is the sig sag movement, zigzag movements. Again, highly lubricate the area, the love handles with your conductive gel. The wand must have consistent contact with the skin and you will be massaging this area in zigzag motions. What's the science behind this specific pattern? This zigzag pattern ensures that you target different layers in orientations of fat cells, breaking them down more effectively, specifically around the love handles. Why? Because the love handles are another problematic area that can benefit from a more intricate pattern of movement. The zigzag motion helps to ensure that no area is left untreated, giving you a more thorough treatment for fat reduction, especially fat reduction for the love handles. This is technique number two, zigzag motions for the love handles. Again, this should also be done for 15 to 20 minutes for this body part in particular. Now moving along to method number three, which is linear strokes for the thighs, for the legs. First and foremost, make sure that the area is well lubricated. Be very generous with your conductive gel. This technique involves the use of your wand in a vertical, linear, like strokes from your knee up to your upper thigh or from your upper thigh down to your knee. What? What's the science behind the linear strokes, you may ask? The linear strokes allow for a systemic and even application of the ultrasonic waves, which is particularly effective for the elongated muscle groups in the legs. This technique right here is the technique you need for the thighs, for the legs in order to reduce that stubborn fat in that area as well as cellulite in that specific area. I know those are large areas, which is why these are the areas in which you need to be doing this technique. 
This technique is great for targeting cellulite and sagging skin. Common issues for the thighs and the legs. It can improve the skin's texture and reduce the appearance of fatty deposits. This technique will be your best friend for that area. If you like this video or found it helpful in some way, like and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them down below. And tune in for our next video. Bye.